So hi, Microper Hunter here. This here is a slide tray that I made, unfortunately a little bit deformed, it's bent, um, because I wanted to make the slide tray for dishwashing my used microscope slides, because washing them by hand is a little bit too time consuming. So I decided to 3, uh, 3D print uh, a slide uh, tray to be put into the dishwasher. And this is the result here. I'm gonna tell you what the problems were and uh, also a solution at the end. Before actually starting the 3D print project, I wanted to test the plastic uh, because I wanted to know whether the plastic is sufficiently heat resistant, resistant to withstand uh, the dishwashing process. So I put this little plastic boat made out of PLA plastic into boiling water and it was sufficiently stable and it stayed hard, it did not turn soft. Well, after all the PLA plastic melts at around 200 degrees, and uh, so I decided, okay, I'm just gonna start uh, designing uh, the slide tray. And uh, this is uh, the first uh, prototype uh, that I made. And uh, the slides are spaced approximately two millimeters um, apart. And I said, I'm just gonna try this and, and give it a go. And uh, the printing, the 3D printing actually took around three hours. And uh, the product, uh, the project essentially was uh, one that uh, actually required quite a bit of patience. And after three hours it was finished, but generally I was uh, generally satisfied. It looked sufficiently solid. Uh, usually it's always the danger that some parts might break off. Uh, but then again, um, it's a, a proof of concept. Yeah, the slides here, I first had to remove uh, all of the cover glasses because I did not want to have them flying around in the dishwasher. And I sorted in um, all of the slides uh, and found out that maybe two millimeters of this spacing might not quite be um, enough. Uh, but then again, I said, okay, I'm just going to give it a try. Yeah, so some of those slides uh, have been placed into uh, some water to actually make it easier for the cover glasses uh, to be removed. And uh, so I uh, soaked them in water for some time and exchanged the water. But essentially, they were not really clean yet. Um, one of the things that we have to be careful is, is that uh, there is no detergent left over from the dishwasher. Uh, because this might actually harm water microorganisms that you want to observe. I simply used a rubber band uh, to uh, hold everything down because I did not want the slides to fall out during the dishwashing process because there is a forceful water stream. And I placed it uh, directly <laughs> next uh, to my dishes here and I uh, wanted to give it a try. And again, after approximately one and a half hours, um, I wanted to inspect uh, the slides and I discovered that unfortunately the slide tray was not stable enough and that the rubber band uh, pulled everything together and the heat um, of uh, the dishwashing process deformed the slide. It was actually, I thought it was kind of funny a little bit. Um, in any case, it uh, doesn't matter. I just wanted to check whether the slides are sufficiently clean um, or if there's still any residues um, on it because this is actually the most important thing here. For me, I can always design myself a new slide tray. And generally, I was satisfied. Generally, the slides were clean, definitely uh, much uh, cleaner than before, and also much cleaner than uh, the original uh, when they came out new, because they were not pre-cleaned. So I might actually also use this process to clean new slides. However, some slides still did contain some water spots or some residue from the dishwashing detergent, and that is something that should not be. Uh, but this could also be because uh, the slide tray was bent, so the slides touched each other, um, or the spacing was not uh, large enough. So the remaining slides I decided to directly sort into uh, the dishwashing uh, tray directly, and I also uh, used rubber bands to help hold everything back. And uh, of course this saved uh, a lot of time, and uh, those slides that were not sufficiently clean, I'll simply yeah, give them an additional clean cleaning. Um, but in any case, it saved quite a bit of time and it was definitely much better than before. But again, one has to be a little bit careful about the dishwashing salt and the dishwashing detergent that might still be on the slides. So, uh, yeah, I decided to design a new version. Um, I did not 3D print this one yet, uh, but maybe I'm not even going to 3D print it because it also works when you sort, in, sort the slides in directly into the dishwasher. So I just might use that as well. Okay, folks, that's it. Uh, please do consider subscribing if you like these type of videos. Uh, yeah, I think that's all I have to say. Leave your comments behind. Happy microbe hunting as always and uh, see you around next time. Bye-bye.